Hello friends, family, and the rest. It is I, Fallen Fury. Welcome back to my Let's Play Dead Rising. I really do apologize for that, um, abrupt ending and speed up at the end, but I had to do it, because, I mean, like, the zombies just Follow keep me. coming, and they keep being so stupid. Come on, Aaron, stop being Come stupid. On. Now, if they aren't close enough to you when you open the door, they won't be in the next plaza when you're there, so, um, it's very important that they're actually relatively by you when you go in the next door because their health will slowly deplete when you're not in the same places they are and they will eventually die so that's not good oh thanks for shooting me in the very beginning Bill you're an asshole okay let's see uh... Lee getting carried okay not be stupid this time okay okay I just constantly press Y when you're walking, not constantly, but like do it periodically every couple seconds or so so they don't stop following you. Alright, they're good. Follow me! Now, they don't need health, but I'm just gonna go through here anyways to avoid zombies. But this place is good if you want to give them health, but not you don't really don't need health. Cause they're pretty good actually. What are you guys doing? Okay. You guys stay there. I'll go kill these assholes. See, that's why I don't like it, because it's like, Frank! I can't take care of myself! I don't have any weapons. I'm just gonna use it. I apologize. I really do. I don't like to use it, but I have to! Alright. Come on, Frank, do forever. Now you think that means that they're in trouble, like it's like a zombie or something there that they can't kill. But no, they're just being desperate and lonely. Alright, I finished. Okay, good. I'm gonna get you some health, because I need health too, honestly. I'll eat that milk or drink that milk. I didn't mean to say eat. Okay. What? Oh my god, they're annoying. I've had it. Damn it. You shouldn't have. Here, give this to Sophie. Damn it. You have. All right, they're fully healed, the ones that are needed, and let's Follow go. Me. They probably took the most damage because I was hitting them. Crap, the zombies are back. I didn't mean to... Thank Frank, you that's the problem. The only problem with that is you have to, uh, you know, be worried about the zombies around you. This space Rider Machine in Wonderland Plaza looks like it's out of control. Maybe there's someone out there. You want to check it out? All right, we'll do that in a second. Let's go, 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 go! Don't bother with the zombies later. There. You're probably gonna get caught by them anyways. There's like three zombies there. What can they do with them? Okay, good. They actually got away. God damn it. Are you guys good? No, no, no. I don't want to do that. Oh, well. I'll get him. I'll get him back in a second. Cutscene time now. Damn. So many zombies around. What can Frank West do? B! I hate bees. I'm so allergic. Oh my god. Whoa. Maybe he has red eyes. Ah! Get away! Stump. <laughs> stump. Stump, stump. Now, Frank is dealing with zombies. Why the hell is he worried about some kind of some bee? You know, like, I think a zombie bite would hurt a lot more than some freaking. Like. You know. Whoa. What in the hell is going on around here? <laughs> Ew. That's gross. Well, I was the can't that bee that I just killed. But why? Why? All right. Leah's fine, but no one else is. And as you see, their name appears on there, and their life is slowly depleting. But um, you'll notice that there's some zombies that do this. They don't attack you. They don't do anything. They just do this. But you see those red dot on their back. Kill them. 
and you get a queen. Follow me. Um, if you're really in a pickle, um, you can um throw that jar down and it'll kill all the zombies in like a five foot radius around you. So it's pretty good. Are these are these people really that fucking stupid? My God. All right, come on, over there. Aaron! Stop getting caught on Come on! Damn it! Did I really have to punch you? Damn it! <laughs> Should have to fucking do that. Come on! Leah close enough? I think she should be. This is a f only really one that's really, really, really annoying. The rest are actually not that bad. Carry Leah. Should be fine. I'll give you an example of what this uh, Queen Bee does when I see some zombies in the general area. Right now, there really isn't much. Um, take this basic route back to the security room. Uh, yeah, so... Put Leah down, open the door. Thank you very much. And... A few zombies there. Break food? Huh? Yeah? Go over there. Owie! Frank food! Alright. Follow me! Over there! Now you'll see in a second why I hate the AI in this game. One of the multiple reasons why I hate the AI in this game. I really hope they switch that for Dead Rising 2. I really do. Okay. Mmm. Carry her. Come on. Follow me! See now at this point they're safe. They're safe from harm. Completely. If they die, it's your own damn fault. Very much. Tell them to go up here and you'll see the mass confusion that arise over here. Okay, Burke got up. Bill got up. Surprisingly this actually isn't that bad. They just stagger a lot. You know what I'm saying? Huh. And they run, they have to be like, ha! Alright, they woke it up. Alright, that's actually not that bad. I'm surprised you guys are actually not getting away. Come on! You guys aren't retarded. And once they're up there, you can just put them in the security room and they're all good. Thanks. Phew, it's been a it's been a hell of a ride, but I feel safe now. God damn it, I hate this. I hate to ask for so much. But it's over now. So Going here for a cutscene. Hmm. So that's what Dr. Barnaby said, huh? He didn't say shit. The old coot's not dumb. He wants us to call for help first. We gotta line out or what? There was no hair in your face. <sighs> the signal's being blocked. I can't even contact HQ on the emergency line. So, if we want to get our hands on Dr. Barnaby, we're going to have to secure a way out of here ourselves. Yep. All right. We've got to deal with the situation we've been handed. The boneheads back at HQ might be working on something, too. There's a helicopter coming. Yep. Three days from now. At noon. It's my ride. Is your ride reliable? You know, I just kind of met him on the fly, and he That's said he might I come back, and he doesn't even know my name. But yeah, sure, he's reliable. All right, then. I'll see to it that the DHS picks up the charter fee. Can we take Dr. Barnaby as well? Sure. As long as you tell me what's going on. Okay. I'll tell you what you want to know. Later. We have more Later, pressing business time. right now. If we have to wait here for three days, we'll need supplies. Uh, water, blankets and the like. We'll get Dr. Barnaby here tomorrow morning. I want you to keep an eye on the monitors. Indeed. See ya, Brad. <laughs> Let's rejoice. Yeah, we got case 1-4 completed. Next case will occur at 6 a.m. Right now it is... Uh, 9.41 p.m. So, I think that's good for now. I'm going to go sleep and save. So... I'll call it a segment here because I recorded episodes 3 through 8, I believe this is. 
So yeah, um, saving. But I'll, um, this is Fallen Fury signing out of Dead Rising. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you guys next time. Bye, everyone.